what is up youtube frankie here man aka strokes and in this video we will be doing a unboxing of the ak 400 zero dark plus this is a much awaited cpu cooler um that i was needing for my streaming setup because i multi-streamed on multiple platforms and i needed something to cool down my cpu um this is compatible with most intel processor sockets um including amd am5 and am4 so let's go ahead and take a look at this thing see what it comes with and um, try and help you guys out all right man here we go okay here it is the ak400 zero dark plus we're gonna go ahead and unbox this um, this is a great uh, budget cpu cooler that you guys can buy off of amazon um, they have uh, different variations of this uh, cpu cooler but yes you can find this cooler for under 50 dollars on amazon so let's just go ahead and take a look and see what's inside. All right, this looks like some bolts and uh, plates that come with the package. Here is your detailed user manual so you can set everything up perfectly. Whoops. As you can see, it gives you all the detailed explanation on how to use what and where. And here is the big old cooler. As you can see here, it comes with these big 120 millimeter exhaust and intake fans. The top portion of the design is plastic, but it doesn't affect any of the cooling from what I've read. Here you can see it comes with one, two, three, and four pipes for the heat sink and a pre-applied thermal paste, which is pretty awesome. Then here are the power connectors for each fan. I believe in the package it comes with a separate adapter, so you can do a two into one uh, four pin connection. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the plates and bolts needed in order to install this cooler. All right, here is the Intel backplate if you have an Intel setup for your CPU. And then I believe this is the front plate that you would set your cooler on. All right, here is the two-in-one power connection for the fans. Here are the bolts for your AMD processor setup. And the other remaining little bag is for your Intel setup. And that's everything in the package. Hope you guys enjoyed. All right, guys, there it is, the unboxing. I did want to share another couple things with you about this CPU cooler. Um, there is some clips on the side here that you have to remove in order to take these fans off um, prior before you put in the cooler itself on the motherboard. Um, it comes with uh, pre-applied paste. If I had said that already in the unboxing, but that's pretty neat. Um, so yeah, you just have to take the fans off with these clips right here. And then you can snap them back onto the heat sink and you'll be all set to go, man. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video. We'll see you on the next one, guys.